change your hair. Done. This is a review of the Mocrio Bluetooth speaker. With its left and right front facing speakers and rear subwoofer, you are promised clear sound whether you're using its 3.5mm headphone jack with the included auxiliary cord or if you're using your own TF memory card in its TF slot. The option for Bluetooth is there, but that's where I had a problem. I received mine faulty. I was able to open it up and repair it as it was just a small connector cable that had come off. I also have never had the ability to power off or on, which brings me to the next thing. When the device is ready for a connection, it says, Hey, I'm ready, waiting for a connection. And once connected, it then says, Bluetooth connected. Now we're going to test out the speaker. We're not only going to text, test out how easy it is to connect to it and play music, but I'm also going to be riding my bike on a track. Hmm. So I guess I'll start by finding a... Oh, I have my phone in this hard alumin, aluminum, aluminum case. Uh, a link to buy this is in the description down below. Please use the link because then I get a little bit of a reback for advertising the product. I'm not being paid for any of this, by the way. So, let's see how easy it is. First I will just unlock my phone and... Off we go. Now I need to go into my settings, go into Bluetooth, connect to it. Connecting. Bluetooth connected. There we go, it's connected. Oh crap! Oh. Oh. No. Okay, now I need to go into my file explorer. Oh. This is a file explorer and find some non copyright music. This is a lot harder. <laughs> okay. I'm going to have to do that, do that run again because I dropped the Bluetooth speaker. So, let's go again. Okay, guys. I'm back at the top of the track. Now, attempt number two. This time... Oh, I dropped it on the way down. Some dirt on it. Ugh, it's not going to do anything. Now, this time, it's going to be on the assumption that you've already connected it via Bluetooth. So all I have to do is go in and find the song to play. I'm most likely going to be holding this on my handlebar. Okay, so, unlock my phone. One, two, uh, and let's go. Okay, so... To my file explorer. Now I've got to go into my royalty free music. Now into that folder for specifically for this video. And now I've got to play the first song I can find. And there we go. Now that I've chosen the song, I can focus on actually riding my bike and taking up some a bit of speed. Oh crap! Okay, so I have no <laughs> <laughs> So, I managed to drop the speaker again, but as you can possibly hear, it's perfectly fine. Now on to the next test. The drop test. Where this, where this Bluetooth speaker will be dropped down, uh, it's practically a cliff, that's how steep this hill is. And, well, obviously, I'll bike down on it, bike down on my bike afterwards to retrieve it. So, let's go. Okay, so now we're at the endurance test. This is also going to be kind of a distance test, because I'm going to have my phone up here. Where I'm going to throw this speaker down this hill. 
while it's playing music. You'll probably hear when it cuts up. Uh, also, I apologize for any bad sound quality. I am only using a GoPro Hero 4 because my main camera is flat and also my recording unit is kind of flat too. So, let's play the music and throw it down. I'll turn it right up. As you can see, I'm holding my phone out like this. It's just cutting out. Now, let's go find out where it landed. Just slowly going down the hill. Ah, oh, I can see it. Oh. Okay, so, I just reconnected. And let's have a look. Any damage? No. In fact, all that's wrong with it is it's a little dirty. But we'll clean that up. In the water test. Okay, so now we know that this can definitely withstand rain, we will try a complete submersion. The music will cut out. Keep it centered. And there we have the end of that. So, highly advisable. Like, share, subscribe, check us out on Facebook, Twitter, and Google+. Now, I give this Bluetooth speaker A plus ratings. Currently we're rendering out the video, and I thought I'd try out the speaker. I plugged it in, said it was charging, connected my phone, said it connected. So I thought I'd play some music, and guess what? It still plays music! Holding its charge. This is a truly legend device. I advise you buy one. Because it completely cut out. Like I left it sitting there and it was making a hell of a noise and it finally cut out a few minutes ago. And it's still working. The, char the charging light isn't working. But that's okay, it's just a charging light. It tells you when it's finished charging anyway. So, big ups for this. Amazing! Amazing!